Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man 5 Part 4 Slash Let's Discuss. This is Ron Moore along with the Wii Guy and Star Soldier. Why am I even here? Because <laughs> you love this game. You know you do. I don't. I honestly don't. Why are you guys pressuring me to like this game? <sighs> it's cool no need to like pressure. It. Cool people like it and we thought you are cool. Yeah, we thought you are cool, man. How can it be cool when it's this bad? It's so, this pink. So How can now... I make a man game be cool when it's this friggin' pink? Is this a game for little girls? Might as well be because the difficulty is so easy. Well, Mega Man was pink in Mega Man 2 when he was Quick Man. Uh, oh yeah, I think they that meant was to have still RV. awesome though. He had quick blades. Here, the whole thing is pink. You know. Some people can do pink, like Bret Hart. <laughs> Mega Man can do pink if he has the outfit. The whole castle can't be pink because it looks like a dream house. A Barbie dream house. It's such a waste. Oh, your face is a tree house. <sighs> oh. How is that, that burn? How is that burn? <sighs> well, anyway, wait, this is Wally's castle. Stage one. Jump on the eyeballs. I like to call it ECW castle. Oh. I don't. <laughs> oh, this is WCW Castle. No, it's not. Shut up. It looks like a indifferent face of the way the eyeballs were lined up with that. Indifferent video game nerd? Yep. Uh, more pink. <laughs> I think this game just wants to troll Star Soldier. It's trolling everybody. Well, I guess we're in Dustman stage again. Uh-oh. Yep. They reused the model. Yeah. Recycling more content. <laughs> we can't come up with anything new. I think Captain Planet was going to be a robot master, but I don't know. They didn't get the license. Hmm. <laughs> Unfortunately, they already used up the names like Fire Ice. Heart. Heart, well, heart, heart man. man. Yeah, Heart, heart man. man. With the power of love. There's uh, Heart well, Water Man. <sighs> Seriously, why am I here? I don't get it. Can't, you can't resist. All you people are defending Mega Man 5 here. I still don't understand why. Because it's cool? Yeah, Gage and Goomba, who I agree with. Uh, I don't agree with him. But he's too scared to answer any of my, you know, relevant questions I have about Mega Man 5. No, I make a video that's way better than his, yet he's too, you know, afraid to even respond. No, he oh, just don't... here's the... Uh, AVGN glitch, boss. He just don't respond to trolls. He doesn't respond to the truth. <laughs> he can't handle the truth. Yeah, he can. He, he just speak the truth. Mega Man 5 is awesome. Yeah. Here's a... Yeah, this, this boss is right here. Yeah, let's jump on the platforms. I like that. That's unique how you have to actually hit them to move yeah. them. Yeah. <sighs> it looks like a Russian doll or something. You know, those things where you move... Yeah, it's a little dolly. What? Think about it. You got the pink palace and everything. And you get this little dolly here. Oh, it's You're just... Dolly. Hello, dolly. Dolly Parton. Too kiddish. I beg you, dolly Parton. <laughs> yeah. Dolly it's Parton. like we're going through all the motions all over again. Well, these motions no, even before. the things he's shooting now that you are like little figurines. Ouch. I might die at this thing. I'm Dr. Wily, I'm gonna take over the world, and I'm gonna throw my uh, dollies at you in my pink palace here. I think he's you're using do uh, <laughs> Dr. Cossack stuff, because he was Russian. Yeah. Oh, shoot. <gasps> oh, Ron, I see don't do I it. I wanna see if I can not use my E-Tank here. I don't wanna be Skip Rogers. No! Oh! Oh, oh come but on, I shot him in the face! E -tanks by now? Oh! No. I'm gonna be a man, and not use E-Tanks. Yes. Yeah. Just use save states. Or whatever. You don't even need it. You got like 20 lives or something. 50 E tanks. Max out on Because the game throws you every possible easy thing there is, so the game is a total cakewalk. Oh. I'm more look, pink. It's more like purple, actually. Yeah, more like purple, purple yeah. <laughs> more like purple. What do you say, J Man? It's, it's pink. Oh yeah, then <laughs> pig. What? Seriously, how can you defend it now? It's a it's pussy cool. game. 
Of course yes, he did. E oh, Push there's man. even no challenge in that E-Tank. It's just right there. Well, yeah, they want you to get it. Oh. So, you, what, you can have a 51 now? Yeah. 51 E-Tanks? Why not? Is it, a, is it an action 51? <laughs> Area 52? Wait. Yeah, maybe this is the action 53 game. Mario Gonzalez already got to include it. Mario Gonzalez. Oh, you know, he was a composer in uh, Action oh, Seriously, it's so bad. Why are you guys doing this to Not me? Not that bad, come on. And a power glove. Yeah. So bad. Play this game in the Youth Force, it'd be cool. But this is probably the easiest water level i ever seen in a Mega Man game. You're just drowning in hate. <laughs> I'm drowning in the truth. I'm drowning in... I'm drowning in... Uh, oh, more pink. Can we just replace my commentary with a little girl here? Bert, it's a game. It's a game for little girls. It might as well be Barbie Man. That'd be like a my little pony man. <laughs> oh, dude, Bert. Rainbow Dash all the way. Polly Pocket Man. Who? Dude, Polly Pocket. That thing's out of that thing's out of. Uh, that's like, probably Canadian little Pop girl Pop. thing. I don't know. We had it here. Little I girl just... baby shit. Oh, and pluck the you. chicken's back. Fuck you. <laughs> the chicken. Oh, probably shoot. the most creative enemy in here. It's just the chicken. Cheep 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 cheep. Hey, this ain't fair. Yeah, Star Soldier right here trying to crush me. Use the gravity crush. Or oh, wait, what was the one? Crash bombs. I don't know. <laughs> they all suck. I forgot. I was gonna use E tank here. <laughs> use the charge. Use the rush jet. I'm charging you with assault. Oh. On a this good game. This game already assaulted me. You're salty. Oh. Seriously? Do I have to keep on doing this? Yes. Well, been here the I past could three be parts. sleeping right now. I could be going to work, but uh, yeah, work on your. Commentary. I had to watch a comment on the worst Mega Man in history. Even more What's worse than eight. Right, he's the second boss of Doctor Wily's Castle. And guess what? It looks freaking stupid, just like all the air bosses. Oh, you're stupid. <laughs> you're stupid. Come on. Oh, probably, you probably yeah, can you defend game. this little circle. I had enough of your crap. Thing with its big eyes. Remember when bosses were cool, like the Gutstozer or the Gutstozer sucked. The yeah, the giant beat him like three All seconds. the Gutstozer did was like, you know what? Bolts. You guys suck. Mega Man Five sucks. I, that's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. That's it. Oh, so you're gonna leave? You guys can do this on your own. You're gonna leave it like a little pin. Oh shoot! He <laughs> you really hung up. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Well, good. Finally, we don't have to deal with the hate no more. Yeah, finally, God. Commentate you know, on how awesome been, this game is. You know, I've been chill. You know, I, I take his his hate with stride. But really, I mean, damn. I mean, uh, <laughs> I'm glad for once. Yeah, really. All right, so Glad here's the. Go. Yeah, let's talk about something cool. Like, here's the first boss battle with Doctor Wally. This can't get yeah. tricky right here. I remember, I was like, oh man, this is like, like, where's he gonna land? I don't know. Yeah, so I stay in the middle right here and kind of like, I don't know what I'm doing. I guess I kind of confused him. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna get you. Ah, oh, dang it. Yeah. I mean, it's a simple, you know, it's the, he does a pattern and then you shoot him when he exposes himself. I mean, yeah, it's not that original, but still, I mean, keeps you on your toes. Yeah. More than the I... guts man thing that Brian was talking about. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I like good, the Mega Man. I like Mega Man too. The Gustos look cool, but all I did was shoot the hard hats and the little, I think, little bullets at you, whatever. It wasn't as challenging as it looked. And yeah, see, it's like the quick boomerang. You can kill him in like three seconds. Yeah, not even challenging. I don't know what the weakness is here. I guess I use Mega Buster. I mean, honestly, the Mega Buster works pretty good in anything in this game. So. Oh yeah, it's the universal, you can eventually, you know, beat everything if you just have the patience. Ah, dang it. Ha! 
Come on. I think one more squash and I'm dead. Yes. Yeah. Beat the boss. Now right, here we go. Skull Castle again. Oh. Yeah, oh, here we go. The real final Skull Castle? Yeah. Oh, look, it's green this time. Oh, yeah, baby. We're at the final level here. And it's not pink. Who's green with Envy now? Yeah. Gonna start Hero 21? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes, boss. <laughs> Dang, son. <laughs> Alright, here we go. In case you haven't noticed, he has to put his initials everywhere. The Dr. W. Copyright. Yeah. I mean, it smells me the... Uh... I think that battle with Dr. Wally Mega Man 2, like a little helicopter thing, whatever it is, I forgot. She's the bouncing balls at you. Oh, yeah, it's the same, yeah, little. Ah, dang it. <laughs> oh, did you? <laughs> I rode the arrow and it takes more energy off and it does it. <laughs> dang it. Good job. I guess I'll ride into it and crash and die. <laughs> oh, here we go. Now, once again, not a challenge, but I mean, I like the design. Oh, here we go. It was kind of a challenge at first. But now, I mean, yeah, all I gotta do is use beat. It's probably the only time in the yeah. game I use beat. Yeah, and once again, it's a simple pattern, wait, and patience. I think you can okay. use the, um, oh, what is it, God, that you can also use to whittle down more health. I forgot. Well, sometimes, sometimes tweet, a uh, tweet, Twitter, whatever, tweet, whatever his <laughs> name is, um, he'll, like, see, right now he's not doing it, but he'll fly and, ouch, idiot, he'll fly in the area where he's about to, Dr. Wally's about to appear at next. Yeah. I guess he does it when he wants to. I don't know. Maybe he's got to be near the area he's going to show up at. Yeah. Even if it takes a while, I definitely like uh, the Wily final boss theme here. It's pretty yeah. nice. Yeah, I like this final battle theme. Ooh! Look out. Yeah, it is a bit unfair when he does go like way above your jumping height to hit him. So, but of course, yeah. if you got beat, it's, it's pretty simple. I didn't the very first time I played, so I, I had a lot of waiting to do to get him. Yeah. Well, just a second ago, he appeared where Dr. Wally was going to show up at next. All right, that's the end of him. I'll just use my Mega Buster. <laughs> yeah, maybe it was the bomb, the end bomb, Napalm bomb, I think. If you get close enough to him, you can. That takes off a good amount of health, I think. Oh, wow. Well. Damn! That is it? Uh-oh. Oh, I've been foiled. Again! Oh, come on, he can't run faster than Dr. Wally? Come on. Move pretty fast for old guy. Not just Dr. Light. He's like, here, I'll show you where he is and I'll beg for mercy. Yeah. Uh-oh. JK lol. Whoa. Dude. Make me pretty strong. Yeah, he's holding, like, an entire castle wall, or roof. Oh, wait a minute! They're going to be one thing! Proto Man! As the ceiling stays up for three seconds so that they can escape. <laughs> <laughs> As the castle destroys itself. Or castle problems. crashes. Yeah, castle, castle crashes. crashes. Uh, and Proto Man sneaks off into the <laughs> abyss. <laughs> okay, the ending is kind of lame right yeah, here. Yeah, I guess but... the ending pretty lame, but, I mean... Like, it has to be like, oh, well, you know, what, what else is there? Dr. Y, he was the villain. Now he escapes again to get, make Mega Man 6. Yeah. And so here's the Robot Masters. Gravity Man was ECW Wave Man. His stage music was real cool. And the Bubbles part. Definitely. Stone Man's music was cool. They're all pretty good. Um, I think Charge Man would be one of my favorites. Who do we agree was the worst? Star Man? Gyro Man's music, too friendly, but... It's still pretty good. I still liked it, yeah. Star Man, I'm not a big fan of Star Man. One Star Power! <laughs> One Star Power? That's what Ryan's gonna give this video. This is a stupid Except... robot master right here, but I, li I like his stage. Charge Man. Charging you with... Well, not Assault, I already said that joke. <laughs> hey, Paul Man, pretty cool, but kind of a weak fight. Yeah, he totally could have like had he like nuked everything if he wanted to. He could have had more of an arsenal. And Crystal Man, and eh, not too crazy about the Robot Master, but the stage and music's pretty cool. 
Yeah, when it comes down to it, even though if the Robot Masters weren't original, their stages and music were pretty dang good. Yeah. I saw, like, a Avatar a long time ago on the forum of Starman, and it showed him, uh... Man, I think he threw a star... Uh, it, it shows him throwing a star at something, and he gave someone a one-star rating. <laughs> ha! Pretty cool. One-star power, once so, again. Alright, which one of these guys is the composer we got? Well, it would... Well, the composer of this game was... Let's see. How do you pronounce it? Miri Yamaguchi? So... I gotta... It, they're probably using an alias in this one, so... Christy Yamaguchi? Yeah, if there's a... Oh. If there's a... It's, yeah, it's... Yeah, Mary Yamaguchi. It's M-A-R-I. I think they just used her first name, or his first name. I don't know the gender. Yamaguchi-san? <laughs> yeah. There was a Japanese wrestling manager in the WWF years ago named Yamaguchi-san. <laughs> what a name. Oh, yeah, I think here is where it'll list, list the, uh, the composer, because I think the... Tampon! Oh, Tompon. Oh, jeez. Tompon. Jeez. Bamboo! Ari. There it is. Mari! Or Mary, I don't know. Mary? Mary. Sound composer. Yeah! Did a great job. Yep. As Pete tells us, this game is made by Capcom. And... So just beat it. Yeah. Beat it! You beat it! You did beat it, Ronnie. Yeah. Sure did. And so, yeah. That is the end of Let's Play Mega Man 5 for the NES. Uh, definitely one of my favorite Mega Man games of all time. I first played it in the summer of 94. Really enjoyed it. Um, and yeah, I mean, at first it was real hard, but over the years it becomes a game that's pretty, it's pretty simple. So it, it definitely is not one of the most challenging Mega Man games in the original series. But I really enjoyed it. It really helped make my summer great. And, uh... For that year, summer '94, really enjoyed it, and me and my, a lot of my friends played that game. One of my friends had it, and we just played it a lot. That that year, that summer, along with Mega Man X, it was real awesome. And uh, so yeah, I really enjoyed Mega Man Five. The, the great soundtrack, challenge, not very challenging I mean, once you get used to it. Um, and the Robot Masters, I mean, yeah, some of them were kind of dumb. Uh, Charge Man. Um, Gyro Man's not that good either, but I mean, Robot Master is definitely not the best. But at the same time, Capcom is running out of ideas because after I said, you can tell that in Mega Man 4, robot names kind of got stupid. But at the same time, I mean, there's still some that are pretty cool uh, in Mega Man 5. Gravity Man stage, uh, I mean, it was real awesome. It's very different for uh, the Mega Man series at the time. No other Mega Man game, you know, to like walk upside down and all that stuff. It was really cool at the time. And so, I mean, Mega Man 5. Uh, uh, of, course, of course, like, Mega Man 4, it was, it was believable. At least, well, even though back in my mind I knew Dr. Wally was the boss in Mega Man 4, it was still kind of believable then I Dr. Cossack was the boss. But then in Mega Man 5, you didn't really fall for it no more, and you definitely didn't fall for it anymore in Mega Man 6. So Mega Man 5 was kind of predictable. I knew at the very beginning of the title screen, yeah, I'm, I don't think Pro Man's the boss. You're not fooling anybody. But it was still cool, and uh, I, I enjoyed Pro Man's Castle, the soundtrack, uh, so I really love this game. It has a real, uh, real good charm to it. Uh, really takes me back, and I really, really enjoy. It. I give this game an 8.5 out of 10. We got mm, very nice. So yeah, Mega Man 5 would be the actually the last game I would play of the original six games, and of course the game is definitely not original. Definitely they're running out of ideas. But I mean, when you come up with a fifth game. In the series, I mean, it's kind of hard to really meet expectations to, like, make it even better than before. Even though you, they have, or did do a lot of aspects I thought were much better than, the, like, the previous four games. The, um, I really do like a lot of stages. Gravity Man's definitely, like, the highlight with the, being able to, uh, fl uh walk on the, the roof and just have to deal with the, the, uh, that whole thing. And of course, uh, white uh, why, writing on the uh, like the, the writing's uh, on the jets, wall. The, the writing is on the wall. Then when you ride the jet ski in Wave Man stage, I really like that. It was a nice change of pace to just you know be like on a, like a little uh, on rail like <laughs> like jet ski stage. You know that was pretty nice. And I like Crystal Man stage, Napalm Man, even Charge Man of course. But his tr dumb train design is definitely like one of the worst. But yeah, I mean. 
I just I, I I loved it. It's even though it wasn't that original, there was something to like the stages and of course the great soundtrack that just made it stand out for me. I just really loved playing the stages and going through one of my favorite Dr. Wily themed castle music stages and Proto Man stage was uh, Castle was also awesome as well. I just I did I just love this game. I d- I do. And no matter what Brian says, he'll he'll never he'll never beat me down with his negativity. Cause this game is awesome. Yeah, he never beat it's, you down. Yeah, beat. So beat it. Just beat it. I will give Mega Man Five. Mm, yeah, like around a around an eight out of ten. Darn good. I like it. One of my favorites. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So that is it for Mega Man Five, and uh, we will see you guys later. I'm Ron Moore. Oh hell no. Oh, well, wait a minute. This isn't over till I say it's over. The blue hell. Okay. How'd you, how'd you get I back in the call? Quit. The world needs to know. The world needs to know that this is the worst Mega Man ever, and I'm sick and tired of hearing this love fest. Yeah, I could still hear you guys from the toilet. I was taking a Mega Man 5 dump out there hearing all that shit you guys talked. Oh. Now the truth is going to come out. Why is this the worst Mega Man 5? You got the worst weapons. You got a lane charge kick that you're forced to use. You know, you're pretty much going forward with an attack that may or may not work. So you get hit (laughs) and the enemy may or may not take damage. That's bullshit. Mm-hmm. And then you get the power stone. Oh, that's a circular weapon that you can't really control. Oh. Oh, just such lame weapons. The lamest in Mega Man history. Yeah, if anybody wants to make a top 10 list of the worst weapons, you pretty much got uh, all eight there on Mega Man 5. Ah. Oh, and you can get letters to make beat. Who cares? It's just a stupid little bird. Oh, look at this. I'm spelling letters again. Bird. Yay. It's only useful one part of the game. Yeah. Shit. Oh, Holy shit. It. And Okay. And let's talk about that music, eh? Yeah, you got wussy soundtracks throughout the stages. Oh, hell no. <laughs> no. Oh, you oh, may no. like them, but they don't belong in a Mega Man game, which is an action game. You're jumping and you're shooting, and it's hardcore stealing action. You're stealing cool weapons off people, but not Mega Man 5, where weapons are shit. No, it's all relaxing, calm, easy-going music. Ah. And the graphics? Huh? The castles are pink. So oh. The game is for little girls, especially with the easy little girl difficulty. ECW? Hey, little Betty. Hey, little um, Mary Sue. Why don't you play Mega Man 5? <laughs> it's a game for you. Oh... Oh. I, oh my god. The world has to know. I don't care. I don't care what Cornshot says. I don't care what Gaijin Gumen says. I would jump on his head and get 100 points for defeating him <laughs> in that stupid little discussion. Oh, it's the best main man game ever because it's so easy. No, it's not. You play it. And there's no reason to. Once you finish it, there's no reason to go through it again because the weapons suck. Oh, maybe I'll use a charge kick in different areas. No, you can't use it in any areas. Oh, my God. And controls and everything are fine because it pretty much plays like the other Mega Man games out there. Except it's way too easy now. Mega Man games. Oh, 1 through 4 had, like, a great challenge to them. Mega Man 5, way too easy. Okay, I'm done ranting on this shit. Mega Man uh, 5 here. It gets a 55 out of 100. It's still okay if you can find it for cheap for like five bucks, not a penny more. But yeah, it's so boring. Don't buy it. Don't listen to the hype. Don't listen to these guys with, oh, it's so great because of music. It's all relaxing. <laughs> no, it's shit. It's so disappointing, and it still hurts me to this day how many people like it and how many people give it a free pass just because it's the fifth one in the series. Oh, it's not that bad, everybody. Come on. You're seeing it through rose-colored glasses. It's not that good, trust me. Yeah. <laughs> now that we finished it, we never had to play it again because it was so damn easy. The weapons suck, 
and everything about with the little pink castles and the little lots of music, it's all forgettable drab, and I'm glad we're done talking about this. Now, is this over and done with? Can we go on to the good big mans now? I'm glad you're done talking. <laughs> no, but uh, seriously, well, John Romans' music, yeah, was a little freak, well, not little, real, real friendly. I, it definitely did not fit in a Mega Man game. Uh, I was going to say earlier, the part with the jet ski, uh, not the jet ski, the water ski thing. Oh, no, and, I don't uh, care about that part anymore. And this, and this. No more Mega Man 5. No more <laughs> Listen, Mega Man 5 error. The part about... You hear that, me, uh, Corn Shack? You hear me? All you other people out there that like this game? No, I'm sick of hearing about Mega Man 5. We're well, going to hear more about it, because I was going to say, actually, I was making reference to Mega Man 6. It would have been cool if, like, in Blizzard Man stage, they had, like, a jet ski part or a ski part. At least it would be in the good game. Okay, well, and I so... Guess I, sh- I guess I should cancel that uh, Child's Play stream with Mega Man 5 that you were going to play that game, because obviously you're not going to not gonna do that then. Oh, hell no. You, if you, you wouldn't I've play Mega Man 5, Mega Man 5 for 5 charity. Torture. Oh, man. I, I got to get that I happening. lived in the prison camp of Mega Man 5 already. Well, Star Soldier, we have a nice partying gift for you. I'm going to mail you a Mega Man 5 shirt. Um, Yay. Kind of like the Robot Master shirt I got from uh, GameStop. Anyways. Remember the GameStop shirt I got? Like, uh, make the eight, it says I beat the 8 Robot Masters. It was based off Mega Man 2 when I reserved Mega Man Anniversary Collection. I want to send that one to Star Soldier, but redesign it to Mega Man 5 Robot Masters. <laughs> And then we have, to, we have to make it Star Soldier Who loses hasn't the bet. Who hasn't beat Mega Man 5? It'd be funny if Star Soldier loses the bet. He has to wear that shirt in his next video. Not a whole lot since the game is uncommon. And your five for five bucks even won't be a thing unless... Not anymore. Yep. It's one of the best five dollars. It's the best five dollars we guys ever spent. No. Ten dollars. I got it from you for ten. Oh, ten dollars. I Thank forgot. You. Rip it was off. great. I played the hell out of it. And I lo- you sh- <laughs> we got yeah. his money's worth. Yeah. <sighs> All right, so that is it. We are out here with Mega Man 5. See y'all later. I'm Ron Moore. I'm the Mega Man 5 loving Wii guy. And I'm Arizona World Champ. Please don't play this. Indifferent video game nerd. All right, God bless and take care. Ah! Yay!